thank you very much very much for giving me this the, the chance to present uh, the the poster at San San Gallen uh, symposium our report was structured as to consider the main recommendation on breast reconstruction and radiation therapy and analyze the current open issues deserving investigation and the consensus using a key phases of Delphi process to establish consensus about breast cancer reconstruction and radiation therapy on behalf of the Italian uh, Association for Radiation Therapy and Clinical Oncology. During the first phase of, phase of our uh, study, a core group of, made by uh, 13 experts in breast cancer was asked to define the relevant statements of the topic at end, including clinical radiation and surgical oncologists, and upon med systematic review research was conducted to identify the most relevant existing guidelines and consensus, meta-analysis, and systematic reviews on clinical outcomes and quality of life measures. And these studies that evaluated modern surgical techniques for breast reconstruction on plastic breast conserving surgery techniques and breast reconstruction after mastectomy with focus on the studies evaluating autologous versus implant-based reconstruction and immediate versus delayed breast reconstruction in patients receiving postoperative radiation therapy. After two virtual advisory board meetings, the core group identified then 26 preliminary key statements to be recommended targeting five preliminary key topics based on this uh, literature review, which explore the available evidence. Thereafter, an expert panel of 43 Italian oncologists with expertise in uh, breast cancer was selected and then invited to participate. Uh, uh, 30 radiation and clinical oncologists, more than uh, 12 surgical oncologists and medical oncologists. In the second phase of our work, specific surveys were submitted to the expert panel using the in online survey tools. Um, and uh, for three rounds of, uh, of Delphi voting. And the third, third phase uh, took place during a virtual consensus conference where the expert panel and the core group of the work were invited to discuss in public sessions the results of the online consensus survey and key statements. Uh, main results, in, in immediate breast reconstruction uh, counts several advantages as we know in terms of surgical management, improved aesthetic outcome, lower incidence of symmetry surgery, economic considerations, single hospital stay, recovery period, uh, psychological factors leading to an improved health-related quality of life. However, it may also affect the planning and delivery of post-mastectomy radiotherapy, increasing the complexity of radiotherapy planning, especially when internally mammary nodes are included uh, within target volumes and prepectoral technique is used. On the other hand, delayed reconstruction after post-mastectomy radiotherapy is often associated with major risk of revision poor cosmetic outcomes to do, due to skin fibrosis. Uh, thus, generally, immediate reconstruction is offered to women who are not expected to receive adjuvant radiation therapy, while delayed surgical approaches are more frequently preferred in case of women uh, who have uh, indication or higher chance to receive radiation. However, technical developments is clear that in the field of both surgery and radiation therapy have demonstrated that there is an absolute advantage strictly depending on the timing and the current literature reinforced the importance of a multidisciplinary team management, including the relevance of patients' involvement. Target volume definition delineation in the presence of the IBR should be tailored to avoid the implant. This is now technically possible, crucial, and doable thanks to special techniques to deliver post mastectomy radiotherapy, such as intensity modulated radiation therapy and volumetric arc therapy. Moreover, innovative reconstruction forms could also help in the effort to improve cosmetic results without an oncological impairment. Although contemporary regional nodal radiation uh, as a low risk of toxicity, careful radiation therapy planning according to the European ASTRO guidelines for delineation is highly recommended. In conclusion, uh, uh, the choice of reconstructed approach must be uh, for sure individualized. Uh, shared decision making relying on outcome based and patient centered consideration is therefore essential, waiting for higher level of evidence uh, data.